what's up my beautiful people you're yeah, welcome back to my youtube channel so if you're new in this channel you are most and highly welcome so in today's video i'm gonna be showing you just one tablespoon of this is going to remove all belly fat and it's going to remove all stubborn stored fat okay so if you want to know what that is please do continue watching and don't forget to share this video thumbs up this video and also subscribe to my youtube channel turn on the bell right beside the subscribe button all right so you will be notified when i upload a new video if you have any questions you want to ask me endeavor to ask them all on my website be it personal curious or future questions follow me on instagram all right let's dive into this video belly fat and losing of weight we're gonna be needing half cut of lemon Okay, for this thing, then we're not going to be needing too much of the lemon, so just a little lemon will go a long way. Lemon is citric in nature and it helps to cleanse the colon, it helps to remove belly fat and stored general body weight. And also, all right, so to do this, I'm going to be cutting in the lemon, okay? So we're just going to be getting a tea from this lemon. It's ideal to boil lemon. Alright, we're gonna be needing a pot and then we're just gonna be transferring the lemon into the pot, okay? And then the next one we're going to be needing grape. Now grape is one ingredient that helps so much in removing stored fat, stubborn fat and also it cleanses the colon so grape is now is one fruit that is usually not sweet because of the citric the high in citric nature but it would therefore help so much in removing weight then for the grape now if you can't actually take grape directly you can make a tea out of it okay so i'm gonna be cutting the grape Now if you have an organic grape, it usually contains a lot of seed, a lot of seed, and it smells really great also, but it usually does not taste really friendly in the mouth. So we're just going to be cutting this in pieces. Alright, so I'm, go I'm just going to be using half of the grape because we actually do not need too much of that okay so I'm going to be transferring it now before I transfer it I'll just love to squeeze in the juice of the grape because we need that a whole lot so I'm going to be squeezing in the juice and then we're going to be needing moringa powder so if you don't have the powdered moringa, you can actually use the fresh moringa, okay? The fresh moringa is better for this tea, but of course, the dry powder is also better, all right? So moringa helps to clean the colon, it helps for diabetes, it helps for arthritis, it removes fats, and it cleanses your body. It makes you very strong and agile. All right, to make this even better, I'm just going to be taking one cup of this moringa powder. Now your moringa has to be organic guys, you don't Then we're going to be needing a little bit of um, aloe vera stem. Now aloe vera is vast, aloe vera is good for the skin, it's perfect for the body and as well for the hair. Now aloe vera works as a cleanser because it cleanses the colon, remove all stored diseases that is actually not acceptable for the body and it also get rid of fats, stubborn belly fat. So for the aloe vera, we're going to be cutting just a little piece of that and then we're just going to be repairing it, okay? We actually do not need the peel of the aloe vera but we need the aloe vera gel itself inside of 
here okay so now I'm just going to be removing the gel inside the pot all right So to make it clearer, one cup of this moringa is equal to one tablespoon. Okay, if you want, I'll measure that and show you. Putting in two glasses of water, guys. Okay, if you're actually putting in one tablespoon of moringa powder, you'll be needing two glasses of two full glasses of water. Alright, so now let's go to the kitchen and have this turn to a tea, okay? Alright, so I it's actually been boiling for like 5 minutes now, okay? So we're just going to boil it for another 5 more minutes. Now, so that the water of the grape and the moringa can, you know, get into the... Um, the water so you can get all the full benefits of what you're drinking okay so if you don't have moringa powder guys you can as well just use the moringa tea you know moringa tea bag and then you put it inside and boil it okay I also have the moringa tea bag but I needed to use the real moringa powder so it can be very very effective and you will so we we'll have all the full benefits of what we're drinking. So here is the moringa plus grape and lemon tea. Now this is just what you need, guys. Okay, so now we're gonna be straining it. So I kept it for it to cool down a whole lot. So I'm gonna be straining it. Because we obviously do not need the particles of the moringa plus the grape particles, okay? Now for this you can actually store it in your refrigerator, okay? Then you warm it whenever you want to take it, alright? So so every evening you take this and you are going to be loving how you are going to be feeling guys because all of your fats your stored fat is going to be gone okay so whenever as you're taking this guys you don't need to and you don't need too much of carbohydrate food you also do not need um, too much of fatty food so you just eat less and you are going to be seeing that this is going to be working really nice on you okay so i'll let me tell you how this actually tastes all right guys so it has a little bit of bitter taste and a little bit of slappy slappy taste okay it's it's actually not bad but if you want you can actually add up a little bit of lim um honey or dates you know to sweeten the taste but if you ask me i would say you drink it this way just the way it is right now is just how you're gonna drink it all right guys so that's it the taste is actually not too bad it's something you can drink it's actually very friendly and it is way way natural and way effective so if you did love the video please don't forget to hit the like button subscribe to my youtube channel that's if you're new and also don't forget to turn on the bell beside the subscribe button so you will be notified when i upload a new video if you have any questions you want to ask me be it personal curious or beauty questions do that on my website the link will be at my description box and also at my comment section all right guys i'll see you soon in my next video don't forget to be healthy and bye guys